Often, no-code tools are quick to get started with, but are hard to build real products on, as you hit their limitations, lacking the functionality you really need. Except, as a developer, you can fully unlock voice load potential with custom functions, APIs, out-of-app triggers, and more to become more than just a no-code tool and really deliver the experiences you need for all your use cases. Hi, I'm Alex, working on developer content here at Voiceflow. And today I'm gonna to show you five ways Voiceflow is a tool well-suited for developers. There's ways to expand custom functionality. The visual designer is great for development and debugging. We offer full control through APIs. We handle scalability. There's great developer creature comforts. And plus, I'll show you three common ways of using Voiceflow as a developer. So let me show you how. First, as a developer, Voiceflow offers plenty of ways to customize your agent's functionality. Of course, there's basic logic blocks to control the flow of conversations, but here are three topics you might not know you could have customized in your agents. With custom functions, you can write on-app JavaScript to handle logic inside your bot, including sending requests and interacting with the internet. Plus, there's the variable system that lets you pass around information on your agent, just like JavaScript strings. You can do external interactions from inside Voiceflow using the API step to, for example, send rows to Airtable. And by enabling custom actions inside your project, you can trigger functionality outside of Voiceflow by sending a trace with a custom payload that can then trigger functionality inside your app, like opening a Stripe payment terminal or spraying confetti. Voiceflow's visual designer also simplifies the development of agent logic making life easier for advanced users and developers. By helping you not get lost in complex logic, the visual designer not only helps non-developers to understand the functionality of a chat agent, but it also lets you quickly make updates instead of getting lost in some complex state machine code. The visual designer also supports extensive debugging features, letting you start from anywhere inside your project, using the in-app chat box to test your project, being able to set variables manually, as well as being able to control the flow of conversations to find edge cases easily. The cloud platform also makes sharing prototypes with your team much easier to get their feedback. There's no need to install complicated things and have the dreaded, well, it works on my machine. Instead, they can just use an in-browser tester. Plus, once you've run your tests, you can look back at the transcripts in the transcript tab to see what went well with your bot and debug what might have gone wrong. Next, Voiceflow features full API control of your conversations, letting you integrate your chatbot into whichever system or website you're developing. I've actually made a whole other video about using Voiceflow's APIs to develop AI apps, which you can find in the description below. By the way, there's Tico, our in-app chat assistant that can help you write API calls or just generally answer questions to make development much easier. You can also join our Discord community full of like-minded developers helping each other out developing on Voiceflow. Voiceflow also doesn't limit you when you're ready to add more features or scale up. We handle LLM integrations and infrastructure scaling for you and offer enterprise level cloud and security solutions. You can also keep track of all the logic in your app through our content management system, letting you keep everything nice and tidy as you scale up and add new features, as well as enabling increased modularity. You can also group commonly used steps together into components, which lets you reuse them throughout your project, sort of like functions in classical programming. You can export and share your projects, both in real time by adding collaborators and also by downloading them as .vf files, which are pretty much like JSON and are compatible with version control systems like Git. These APIs and features can be used together with Voiceflow's Agent Builder to create countless custom solutions. Here are three common ways of using Voiceflow as a developer. First, you could develop low code using the AI Agent Builder and then deploy rapidly using the Dialog Manager API to your own front end. Next, you could use Voiceflow's knowledge base management and querying APIs to use Voiceflow as a managed knowledge base service for all your custom data. Thirdly, you can also make extensive use of custom actions to trigger events in your own infrastructure, like complex logic in your back end or custom behaviors on your front end. So, overall, we've seen how Voiceflow is a platform built for developers full of power user features that make it viable to create complex agents in a team. I've attached a bunch of resources in the description below that show off some of the features we've talked about. So I hope you give them a shot. See you around.